So today is day 22. Uh, that lighting's awful, hang on. So today, no, oh, there's still crap. Right, so today is day 22 on the road, and today I'm heading towards Western Supermare, but before we go there, let's see what today's sub challenge is. Hang on. Bet it's to spend money, hang on. Make this banana interesting. Tell us a story. Make this banana interesting. Tell us a story. I mean, she hasn't put a banana in there. I mean, I have a banana, but she didn't know that. <laughs> right, okay, well, let's crack on. Sun's coming in from like really harsh angles today. Right, so the plan to go, oh, come on, I need to go over here. Maybe Casey nice at it. Right, so as I say, I'm going to Western Supermare today where I plan on meeting a couple of young lads, Fraser and James, who have been subscribed to my channel for a while. They've been incredibly supportive of my journey and want to meet up, so I'm absolutely keen to meet these guys. And they're also in the very early stages of having their own YouTube channel, so I will also be taking them on in some sort of challenge today. Very much looking forward to doing that. I've also got to try and make a banana interesting, and I've got to win today's challenge with Fraser and James because at the moment I've clawed the series back to 8.13 after being down to 5.13. So actually, I could win this still. Also, don't have COVID, so that's good news. Right, let's crack on. Oh. Oh. Ah. This is the driver's seat. Let's crack on. that when I say this I sound like a broken record because I think I've said it in most videos but I want to keep saying it because it keeps being true I just want to thank everyone so 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 much for the support so far in this series it's been really well received and it's been one of the things that has really kept me motivated to keep going when I've had a couple of like down moments so I just want to say thank you all so 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 much for the support everyone who's watching and everyone I've met so far it's been really lovely and I really do lie back there at night in my sleeping bag reading all the comments so please keep them coming in fact if you're a regular watcher but you never comment then on this video you have to you are morally obliged to comment in fact let's see if we can get this video to the most comments i've ever had that's a mad thing to say i don't know why i'm saying that i guess i'm turning into a full-blown youtuber now be sure to like share and subscribe and smash that fucking bell let's go Right, so I've just arrived in Western Supermare, but I've got here a little bit early, so allow me to quickly introduce the film which is taking picture houses by storm all over the country, Le Banan. Le Banan. C'est bon pour la santé. Quand j'étais petit, j'ai joué le foot parce que c'est bon pour la santé. Mais maintenant, je suis baba. Le banane est mort. Je suis fatigué. Right, that was sort of inspired by uh, Dan Trelfer, but um, I'm not going to ever let him know that. Right, let's crack on. Let's go find these lads. That was good, wasn't it? There you go, Charlie. Still not found them yet. Western Supermare seems lovely though. I think they're this way. All right, guys. So a jacket shirt. There we go. Isn't it just? Hi, guys. <laughs> uh, this is Fraser. Hello, and James. How the bloody hell are you two doing? I'm doing well. I'm bloody doing lovely, well. thank you. We're in. Where are we? This is Western Supermare. This is Western Supermare. The lovely, the, the lovely the town. That town is. of Western. Yeah. Is it, I quite like it, but when I said like, oh, it's quite quite pretty I quite like it you two both well, like laughed at me you, when, when you live here yeah I think for 19 years of your life yeah that is it's yeah it's it's a town you struggle with sometimes yeah. <laughs> it's nice to come to and sort of you know have a day out and a lot of people will come down and sort of if, if you don't live it's, by like the coast it's quite nice to come to but a holiday destination for young children yes <laughs> right do you know I think a lot of people think that I think a lot of people think like oh where I live is a bit shit mm -hmm. like it's nice for a day, but I, as an outsider, I can say I quite like it. I will say that when I first got here, 
there was an absurd amount of fish and chip shops. I was sat at one point and Charlie called me and I like looked around and I could see seven just from the point where I was sat. And I was like, couldn't see over hedges and stuff. So like, I didn't even have complete 360 view. My irritation is no cheesy chips. You go, yeah. you, you go to a Western chip shop, you can't find cheesy chips. And I love cheesy chips. There's some, uh, there's some steps over there. Let's go, let's go over there and have a little, find the have a little sit down and, and we'll uh, talk more about cheesy chips. Yeah, yeah, yeah let's do that. Good. Everyone knows like, oh, sh literal shit. Oh, shit. <laughs> I'll tell you what, I'm gonna sit on a wrapper. How about that? I'll put that a wrapper resource. over a bit <laughs> of shit. Look at that, resourceful. Oh, wow, oh, that is thoroughly that, impressed. I'm impressed, honestly, that's, that was, that's quality. I still feels bad knowing that I'm sitting like, on, on shit. shit. <laughs> <laughs> well, but there's just like a Pepsi wrapper between you, know. you and... Pepsi cherry, Pepsi Max cherry. Oh, oh. So this is nice, isn't it? What it's are we looking at here? What is this, what is that? That, that was a really, really, really long explanation. So I'm going to say, what's that? And then <laughs> you're going to start talking. And then I'm going to cut to that. <laughs> so you lads have grown up here. Yes. You've grown life. up in, in, in Western Supermare. Yeah, oh, I know. But you're like, so you're younger, than, you're, you're quite a lot younger than me. You were both meant to start uni last year. Yes. yes. Um, right. But then COVID hit, so you were delayed for a year. So you're starting uni in September? Yes. Oh, yeah, yeah. That's down incredible. And at Falmouth. Mm. Ah, and you're both actors as well. We are. Yeah. Yes. So I don't know now if like you actually like me or if you're just like... <laughs> I said at the beginning of the video that you were fans of the channel, but also that you both have started your own channels. You're like at the beginning of a YouTube journey as yeah. well yourself. Well, that's 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 what probably what this year's been about for both of us is obviously we're separate channels but we both built foundations to start on. So I should actually say because we should also promote at this point you're <laughs> the nerdy Brit on YouTube. I am. And you're just Fraser Oliver. Fraser Oliver. Because it's interesting isn't it like it feels now like a lot of people want to be um, mm. content creators. I don't want to say YouTubers because there's lots of different platforms yeah. now but let's say content creators. Um, was that something that you wanted to do or was it a reaction to like not being able to go to uni? Well, it was sort of a, I was bored uh, when lockdown hit and it was like, I want to do something right, that I okay. can physically see a result of. Right, okay. Where I can physically look and go, this There's actually is like a I've... document of yeah. this period so when, of time. So when people are like, what did you do in lockdown? I can go, this is what I did and physically show yeah, this with, amount of video. That's very bold of you because I would not show anyone what I've done in my first year on YouTube. <laughs> my God. So what is there to do in Western Supermare as a challenge? Like what would be like a good, like we've got this huge expanse yeah. of, I'll turn the camera around in a minute mm. and I'll cut this over the top. It'll seem super professional. Yeah. But we've got this like <laughs> huge expanse yeah, of um, beach. beach in front of us. I we've mean, got a pier there, we've which pier, presumably we've got, has got an arcade it's in got, it. It's got like arcades, it's got like, um, do we go to the pier? And if there's, if, pit, if there's nothing else there, it, it's just a nice trip on a it's pier. It's really loud in here. It's impossible. Very loud. It's really. I don't know how well this is coming out, but it is. It is really, really loud. So, guys, the idea. I've been to an arcade before, so I was thinking we can't do an arcade. But what I've not done before. It's air hockey. The way we've decided to do this is that it's me on one team, yeah. you two on the other team, and every time a couple of goals are scored, yeah. you'll swap yeah. over. Yeah. Sure. Are you yeah. happy with that? Yeah, I'm happy with that. It's really loud, so you know what this means. Montage? Montage. Montage.
I'll be honest with you, I was kind of expecting to do like a cooking sequence this evening, but the weather is absolutely awful and it doesn't look like it's going to get better at any point in the near future. So what I thought I'd do is I'd go and grab those Jaffa cakes that Scott from Com Hunt TV gave me yesterday and I would do like a food review. I'm not a food review channel. I'm not sure I've ever done a food review, but you know, up first, black currant. This feels silly. My brain initially was like, nope, that should be orange. And I was like, oh, what is that? Second bite, okay. My face may have said differently. I'll be honest with you, I'm kind of not sure how I feel about the fact that these are all different flavors to orange. Why are we messing with perfection? Right, number two is passion fruit. Fetler just walked past, he's looking in. He's trying to, he was walking past and he was like looking in to see what was going on, but he was trying to not look like he was looking in. I saw you, mate. I'll be honest with you, I don't even know if I want to do the last one. I don't know how I feel about this. It should just be orange. It should just be orange. That was okay. I don't know what else to say. I mean, I do need to wash it down with some tea. Uh, cherry. Yeah, cherry. This, I, I don't think this is my thing. I don't even know if this is going to make it into the video. We'll see. It's really weird. With all of them, my gut instinct is no. And then I'm like, maybe. I'll be honest with you, Scott, I really appreciate it, but um, none of these are gonna be replacing regular Jaffa cakes for me. So tomorrow I go to Wales. I'm in Wales for two nights, including I'm gonna be in Cardiff on Wednesday. Now, this is gonna seem ridiculous because I'm an Englishman trying to watch the England game in Wales, but if there's anyone in Wales who wants to watch that with me, let me know, because I, I don't have any plans for that at the moment. Also, post Wales, I think I'm slowly going to make my way back to Lancashire. Obviously not immediately, so is there anyone in between Wales and Lancashire or maybe in North Wales? Is there anyone else who wants to hang out is what I'm trying to say. If so, please get in touch because I don't actually have a lot planned after Wednesday. But yeah, I think that's the end of the video. I didn't actually plan anything for this bit when the music kicks in with the buh, 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 buh. So, um... <laughs> Dancing. I, I, I'm not even going to let it get to the end. That was ridiculous. Don't be a dick.